should have seen the participatory budgeting vote and uh, the Girl Scouts who were flanking the entrances of Roosevelt <laughs> Island. You couldn't get in here without getting handed multiple things. And it's one thing to sell cookies, it's another thing to raise a million dollars. Uh, please join me in welcoming Yitzo, who is actually one of the students who got it done. Hi, my name is Yeta. I'm one of the leaders for the Girl Scouts Troop 3001, along with 3244. This is my daughter Persia, also her leader. She was back here in 2015 and 2016, uh, standing outside the school, telling people about vote the green roof. <laughs> Along with other Girl Scouts also standing outside at the train station asking everybody and telling everybody about the program. We are very happy and excited that the program has actually came out oops, sorry, in full rotation. Here we are. The Green Roof is ready. Can't wait to see it be used by other children. So we're just happy to be here. Thank you. Congratulations. So I actually didn't realize that it took eight years to have this done. Um, it felt a little shorter, but um, because we were already graduated, I guess we can see the other students, especially siblings, their friends, kids, get to use the green roof. Um, so hopefully they enjoy gardening or learning within the garden here. Yeah. Um, I just want to say that we worked super hard. So like Persia was saying, we're very excited for this to be finally open so that the kids at the school can use it. Congratulations. Thank you. You, you get it bad. You get it bad for uh, raising a million dollars. I don't think so. <laughs> okay. Uh, so let's bring all our speakers up. You guys can hang around and let's